Tonight in Stockton, two men are now indicted for last summer's deadly bank robbery and shootout with Stockton police. The indictment charges Jaime Ramos and Pablo Ruvacaba with multiple murders that could get them the death penalty. 90 pages in this indictment, listing dozens of charges against Jaime Ramos and Pablo Ruvacaba, from kidnapping to burglary murder. They have left no stone unturned. Criminal defense attorney Johnny Griffin, who's not connected to this case, says the level of excruciating detail signals the DA's aggressive approach. They literally went through each person who was involved in the case in terms of law enforcement and the public, and each person that was potentially um, uh, subject to harm, they've charged that person as a victim. One of the victims is Misty Holt Singh, whom robbers took hostage. The 41 year old mother died from officer bullets in the shootout. The family attorney has argued that Stockton police used excessive force. If it's determined that these men started the chain of events and someone died as a result of that, um, whether it was the officer's bullets or whether it was the suspect's bullets, um, they can be held liable and responsible criminally. Police say Ruval Cabo was the driver. Whether he could face the same punishment as Ramos depends on the level of knowledge of the crime. If they all sat down before it happened and came to an agreement on the plan to commit this robbery, uh, then they all are equally guilty. According to Griffin, claims that the suspects were involved in street gangs makes this a live case. If there's a conviction here, these young men will not ever get out of prison. That is only if the death penalty is not sought. In Sacramento, Claire Duan, KCRA 3 News.